Have you ever wanted to be a veterinarian or a dog groomer? Here at Sears Creek High School, we have many hands-on programs such as dog, dog trimming, we cut their nails, and we give them baths. Um, here in the next in the next few videos and photos, you'll see examples of what we do here at Sears Creek High School. When trimming a dog's nails, you have to make sure that you restrain the dog and comfortably pull back the dog's paw and make sure that you do not cut it too short. When grooming the dog, we use clippers. And when you shave the hair, you always go in the direction the hair grows. There are many different types of shampoos you should use. With this dog, it's short hair, so you should use a regular shampoo, such as this one. In vet science, we learn about the muscular system, the bones, the organs, and the digestive system of different animals. Our teacher has these models to represent the dog's organs and all that. And we can take it apart and put it back together to better understand where the placements are in the body of these. In vet science, we learned how to find the pulse of a dog by feeling the femoral artery. We have also learned from the simulated dog paw how to properly inject and take blood out of a dog's paw and how to uh, insert an IV catheter. Hey guys, this is a baby chinchilla, Fluffy, that we keep at the small animal lab. And during this class, we learn things such as you can't hold chinchillas by their body like this because they have floating ribs, so you have to hold their tails. Our hedgehog, Sonic. In addition to Sonic, we have a lot of other animals, uh, small animals, actually. We have gerbils and hamsters and guinea pigs. We learn how to take care of all of them and what their diets and how much interaction they need with people. So. We learn a lot about taking care of small animals as well. Hi guys, this is Rascal. He's a ferret. He likes to go outside and play in the grass and then the rest of the time he just sleeps in his bed. Hi guys, this is Buddy. He is one of our two cats that we have here at the small animal lab at Sears Creek. Um, in small animal, he learns stuff like how to give him wellness care and we also learn how to do checkups on animals like Buddy. our small animal pathway, where we take care of large animals such as clover, our pig, and Costco. We also have a pot belly pig and chickens. We chose the animal pathway because I like to learn how to groom dogs and play with small animals. It gives me further knowledge into becoming a veterinarian technologist. I want to be a vet and it gives me experience to gain further knowledge in the veterinary field. I chose this small animal care pathway to gain more knowledge on veterinary I chose this pathway because I want to be a vet and this gives me many opportunities to handle different animals. Hi, I'm Courtney Anity and I took the vet science class because I like all the hands-on experience. Hi, my name is Kayla Mercurio and I took vet science because I want to be a veterinary technician. I'm Elizabeth and I took vet science because I love animals. I'm Jesse and I took the vet science class to better prepare myself for vet school. My name is Amber and I joined vet science because I want to be a vet. This is not animal care pathway. We also have a horticulture pathway. The class that you would take would be landscaping and greenhouse. Welcome to our greenhouse. Here in landscaping, we help maintain around campus by weeding the planters out front and mulch certain areas. We've even helped teachers with at-home landscaping. We've got many different kinds of plants. 
Some we start from seeds, like one says, while others we start from clippings, like these wandering Jews. Now you may ask what we do with all these plants. Well, we have different fundraisers. For example, in the winter, we sell the poinsettias. And in the spring and summer, we sell wonder, we sell the ferns, wandering Jews, and different kinds of fruits and vegetables that you're getting ready to our planting. That is why the greenhouse is into its fullest capacity right, capacity right now. Here in the greenhouse, we mix soil and uh, fertilizers so that our plants get the proper nutrients and minerals to grow big and strong. 